What is going on, people? Welcome back. Johnny here, and we are playing some RimWorld version 1 development build. Just released today, this version. So far, it works just fine with my save file. We should probably get rid of this guy soon. <laughs> okay. Yeah, things are going all right. So far, I haven't had any issues with the save file. Brian Fallon is the slowest walker on the planet, thanks to a mean case of food poisoning no doubt due to Britney Spears' cooking I'll just say that yeah but whatever things are happening Brian's one of our main haulers and sadly he's down and out because we have stuff all over the place that needs to be hauled at this point there's medicine laying everywhere at least it's frozen it is deteriorating due to being outside but frozen helps there's berries laying everywhere that should keep the bears off us for a while how long does food poisoning last does it say Major doesn't say. Be nice to have some kind of idea when this is going to end. If you're going to mind, I would prefer that you work up here, please. There you go. She'll probably go eat soon. Ah, she's such a machine. Why is Frank Turner so sad? Needs. He's hungry as it gets. Alright, that's fair, buddy. Look at that. Silver. We're going to have some legit money. She just wants to go eat. That's fine. All right. Holy shit, she's awesome at that. Mine this, please, my dear. And we'll send Brian over to clean. We have struck silver ore. Do not take out ancient danger. All right, we have a couple more. And then... Nice. Look at that. Look at that, people. Yeah, Brian's on. He's like, I'll take that silver. Okay, Frank, what are you doing? He's out there making medicine for us. Well, let's get you to haul a bunch of this stuff. Did he just take... No, he didn't just take one. <laughs> so Fallon... Mm, Fallon's asleep again, but that's fine, I suppose. What are his needs? I think he's because he's sick, right? So it is what it is. We're going to build a copy of this. Turner. I need you to butcher these animals before bad stuff happens with them, please. Thank you. Brian should come and clean this mess up when he gets on his feet again. That'll be just fine. So somebody's bed. Turner is... He's the most unhappy person here at the moment. Now what's he doing? He's eating. That's fine. Then we'll have his bed moved. Found awake. Why, why won't you clean, buddy? Oh, he'll clean there. All right. Get this room cleaned up nicely. Is this not rock rubble? No, I guess not. I guess that's just what it looks like. Okay, fine. I accept that. And actually, before you go, Brian, I know you really want to haul that cloth, but can you get this hauled out here too? Brittany, I need you to work on this door so that Frank has a bed. A bed. And that'll keep Frank from being disturbed. Frank Turner from being disturbed when he sleeps. Turner, what are you doing? You're chilling. I'm going to let this happen. Oh, they were all almost playing at the same time there. Jeez, tell me we're not back to bed already. We are. At least Brittany's not sharing a room. No more awful barrack. Shit, we just had a raid. Tribes people, they will prepare for a while. Did he just kill a deer? Oh, it's sleeping. Ugh, come on, man. They're going to prepare, so I'm going to let my people sleep for a little bit. Need warm clothes. Well, I think we're about to get some. Well, I don't know. The tribes people may not have warm clothes. Who are these people with? The Niaga... Nagatros of the Bramble. Well, 
They're people we can make friends with. Also, like, yeah. Jeez. Here they come. Everybody, two arms. Over here. Alright, there you go. Let's hope they are bows. If the bows reach far, we're gonna clear the shit out. Stutched him good. Uh oh, Fallon got shot again. God, you guys suck. Nice. Shooter, shooter. You're not getting away, my dear. Okay. How bad did Fallon get it? Don't be bad. Ah, cracked pelvis from a short bow. I guess it doesn't help that he's stoned. Alright, well, we'll get this crap hauled. He's dead. 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 Great. Well, we're not getting any food or any clothing out of this. And, like, it seems like it's going to take less work just to build three graves here. I need you to do that. What are you doing? You're going to go eat. What are you doing? You're going to go rest. That's fine. Yep. Why is it still in slow-mo here? Did one of them get away? No. Well, we don't need it in super fast mode either, I suppose. So there is that. All right. Beautiful. So we're going to have all these bodies in the ground in a moment. Sadly... Brittany here has got to do it. But she does everything well. Jeez, Mad Raccoon. One of my people was just running that way. Brittany Turner. Where's he going to go? He's going to go at Frank Turner, right? Frank, don't botch this. God, you suck. Run like the wind. Well, he's faster than it, at least. So, turn around and blast it. Ah, nice work, buddy. Very well done, Frank Turner. Good shot. All right, the bodies are on the ground. Brian Fallon is in bed. Did he get tended to health? He didn't, he didn't tend. Brittany. What? Come on now, Brittany. Work. You're oh, you're a horrible doctor. <laughs> All right, let's turn on his self tend because it's as good as it's gonna get. And I guess we'll wake him up and have him tend himself. You, my dear, get over there. There, so once that's done, we have a ton of these chunks laying around. Eight and six. That's fourteen. That's a lot of chunkage. Somebody's got to be doing this work. Brian got tended. That's well and great. Frank, do this. Thank you, sir. Ah, stupid attack on us, man. What do we get out of it? Nothing but, like, crappy bows. Poor bows and a poor steel knife. All right. So he's going to do that. That's all well and good. All right, Brittany. Oh. Well. She actually has a bedroom now. I'm going to let her finish that. And we're going to put her bed up here. On a permanent wall. And then we're going to put a door in. It's going to be horrible for a while, I'm aware. And that bed is just extra. Now, please work on that. What's Brian's situation? Yeah, he's not doing too well. He's going to be in extreme pain for a while. That much I can tell you, people. Okay. She's going to do that. And then we'll get her to clean up her bedroom. Yep. Keep on scrubbing. And now let's get these hauled. And these hauled because they're slowing us all down. And I guess we'll do something dumb and expand this zone for the moment. So we have somewhere to put it all. Even though this is Brian's work. Well, first let's start with these because they're really slowing you down. Who's breaking now? Low medicine. 
fine. Fine. Oops. I got a little overzealous there. Oh, he's making eyes at her. Brittany has no time for you, Frank Turner. This is Brittany's bed. Thank you. All right. She wants to go to bed really bad. Well, I guess we have to let her at this point. All right. So let's set up some more smoothing jobs. So we can run power down there and get lights in there. It would be nice. All right. So we'll get these two areas taken care of. And then... We'll figure out where to go from there, right? Frank's going to make blocks like a madman. I guess I could have put that a little closer, but what are you going to do? You need to go to bed or something, don't you? Fine. All right, this bed could probably just be moved out of the way, right? For the moment. Beautiful, people, beautiful. Everybody has a bedroom. <laughs> the chunks are getting taken care of. What do we have? Six. Ooh, we still have 14 chunks. That's a lot of chunks. Well. All right. So those people were trying to hide over here when we were shooting at them. We should move this out some probably, but... What are you going to do? These bodies are still here. They'll be gone before too long. How are we doing with these bodies? 61, 95. A coma child. Starvation. Who's starving? Brian Fallon. Well, you know what you could do, buddy? You could get up and eat. There you go. Oh, shit. How are we doing for meals? Not good. We're going to have to make Brittany cook for a day. <laughs> Yeah, she should switch over and cook. And that should be just fine. Now she's going to eat berries, but I think that's just, just great. It is. Slept in the cold. That's not cool. It's already 35. That is pretty chilly. 63 in here. So we need to get this smoothing done so we can get some vents and some heaters. And Son of a bee. Well, like your cooking area is outside, dude. Ugh. <sighs> Can't catch a break here. Now she's going to be stoned and have food poisoning. It's amazing she's still on her feet. Well, and Brian, how's he doing? Health. Mm, not great, but he's getting there. This is all right. 2.7. I wonder if that... It can't be hours, right? 3.1. Hours ought to be happening faster than that. Okay, she's going to cook regardless. That's fine. I guess I could have turned the fire around so the business side of it was over here, but what are you going to do? All right. Nice. Look what Frank's doing here. So why don't you start over here, buddy? Well, let's get some smoothing jabs. That's going to be that room, that, that, these we don't care about for the moment. Yep, oh, knew that was coming. Shit, and she dropped this. Oh, Brian's going to do it. Glorious. We'll have Frank pick up her shotgun when he's done eating. Jesus, now Turner's sick. Get the shotgun picked up. That's important. What is Brittany's cooking? I guess we can't tell because he's picking up a meal. The rice is just going to crap. We have low medicine. Brian's down. Does she need tending? Well, these are her issues. <laughs> oh, what about him? Jeez Louise. Well, Frank, it's up to you, buddy. If you're going to mine, mine in there, please. Tink. Tink. <laughs> Slowest job ever. I guess we... Yeah, we need to mine that out. Alright, where'd everybody go? Frank, where'd you go? Great, he's getting stoned. You know what? 
I think we're going to burn all these drugs. They're just... They're just causing us a big hassle here. Bills. Add a bill. Burn drugs. Forever. All drugs. Frank. Oh, Brian's back. That's good. Frank, you slow schmuck. How's Brittany doing? Not well. Still can't walk. Jeez Louise. What just happened there? Yep. You're, I guess Brian's going to rescue you, right? Once, no. Stop smoking that joint right now. <laughs> he just left Frank laying there. Oh, that's fucking messed up, man. <laughs> Jeez, you're a jerk, dude. What a butthead you are, Fallon. All right, where are you going? Feeding berries to Brittany. All right, will you cook? You won't cook, will you? Is this a cooking job? Refuel work. There you go. What's he doing? He's always refueling it. Cannot merge. He won't construct. Thank you. You are going to burn these one at a time? Really? That's your life plan, dude. Whatever. It's better than what's going on. She's going to go eat after she barfed up her room. That's great. Alright, well. Get rid of the drugs. I can't have this anymore. It's just too much. The whole colony's falling apart because of the drugs. I regret the day I picked up these drugs. Wait. Maybe I can just forbid the drugs. You. So let's try to forbid the drugs. Manage drugs. Select policy. Social drugs. No. Uh, wait, this is for... No, you're going to get over your addictions, you people. There. Let's get that thing hauled in. Where's he going? He's hauling a raccoon. All right. Well, at least he's doing something useful. Oh, gosh. Will she come eat this? Well, hopefully the berries don't make her sick, too. She's had a rough day. Brian should have been going around picking all these up, but apparently that's just not how it's going to work. Jeez, she's a slow eater. <laughs> she's the, All right, and going to cook meals. Fine. What's he getting? He's going to feed Frank Turner. That's just fine. I don't like the medicine all laying in the dirt. Uh, what are you going to do? I would build a hallway off this way. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to try and figure that out. But we don't know how far down... The, once we smooth these walls, we'll see how far down the ancient danger goes. So. Oh, buddy. I tell you. I'm just going to let him relax. She's going to make meals while barfing everywhere. That's phenomenal. She never even got through making a single meal. Thank God I had him cut all those berries because... Otherwise, we'd be starving right now. Good thing we didn't take any additional people as well. Look, now the bunny's... Oh, I thought the bunny was going to eat my berries. Rat bugger. She's in a haul. He's with her on the way back. Okay, good. Oh, great. Food poisoning from berries. Frank Turner. Whew, we can't even get a single meal cooked. Somebody's butchering. There's a raccoon laying there. Forget the raccoon. Cook, my dear. And everybody quit getting stoned. Jeez, he's barfing on the rice. Alright, you know what this is telling me. Well, first off, we need weapons. I'm going to wait for her to finish at least one meal here. So you can equip this pump shotgun. She might be our best shot, actually. She's really good. You can equip this. And Frank Turner, what are you working on? You're going to go rest. Well, on your way, equip that. And then Brian should have a shotgun already. Whew, what a rough day we've had over here. <laughs> oh, gosh. Now it's got crazy barf noises going on. Well, it's reducing because it says initial 
and before it was like major or severe or something so we're getting there if this raccoon goes bad I don't really care too much Frank can deal with it I don't know what he was about to do He'll probably take another simple meal but if this is drugs we are not hops unforbid but whatever that's something we sell anyway Okay, progress, I guess. We all have bedrooms, at least. There's some raccoon meat. Probably don't want to eat it, much like everything else around here. Fallon, you need to get out. Uh-oh, is it snowing? Oh, Lord, it's snowing. It's fall, and it's snowing. So we're in a climate similar to where I'm at here in Wisconsin, people. All right. She's just going to keep cooking. She has to be tired by now. Oh, she's just hungry. Well, after this meal, we're going to let her do whatever she wants. We didn't... We were... Ugh. If I do this, she should just eat it, right? Yeah. No, let's... Uh, yeah, you know what? If those drugs disappear, I'm totally fine with that. Those things... I should never pick them up. They cause a lot of issues in this colony, people. Mm-hmm. But we're going to have to mine this out at some point. And we're going to end up mining these. So we're almost out of mining tasks. I'm going to end up rebuilding this wall, so that's fine. I didn't want this section to be as big as it really is. This is just going to be a butcher room. I wouldn't mind if the door was over here as well. Yeah, this whole room got wonky. Let's just mine it all out. There. Once Brittany gets on it, it'll happen in no time. And you can do that because that'll pretty things up a bit. Oh, nice. Well, despite waking Brittany up, he's cleaned up her room a bit, so that's fair. Where are you going now? Oh, never mind. <laughs> Now, is he hauling berries? Is he hauling medicine? So good. Brian is like back on it. Look at this. Boom. There you go. It's nice to have someone that does the junkie work. Just dedicated to it. Alright. So when Brittany gets back on her feet. Oh, it's back to major. It's because I'm stupid berries. She just ate. She's had like food poisoning on top of food poisoning. It's not cool. I think one thing we could do is like make a bunch of steel traps, make a hallway and make a bunch of steel traps. And then if there are creatures in here, at least that gives them the old zippity zap on the way out of there. No telling what's going to come out of there, but where's Brian? He's hauling hops. Yeah, like I hope you at least brought the medicine with you. Because around here, medicine's been an issue. All right, we'll at least let him get this chunk, and then we'll let him do something else. This one can wait for a little while. This bed's just laying in the middle of the room. What are you going to do? Okay. Hey, look, Brittany's back. Playing horseshoes right next to a fire. That's great. Alright, Frank, you may do whatever you like at this point. Because, yeah. Brittany, what are you doing? How's it coming, my dear? Not great. <laughs> Frank, gonna go to bed. Had a lot of smoothing to do. We're gonna mine this later. So we can probably put some bedrooms over here as well. This didn't this is not how I wanted this base to look, so if we ever pop this ancient danger, what's she doing now? She's gonna go back to cooking. That's alright. Man, all this corn is almost ready. Frank's gonna have a busy day. What's Brian doing? He's just running around getting all the crap that Frank dropped. That's good. Alright. So doors. That door is going to go there for sure. This will all get mined out and then we'll build a wall across it. 
and then I do need to do some smoothing. Nobody's doing these jobs anyway, but just so we know what we're trying to accomplish here. You gotta be careful not to get the walls if you don't want the walls. I think this room mostly got finished. Nope. <laughs> not so much. Okay, perfect. Alright. That's a little bit of progress. I guess. I will probably just end up smoothing this side of it too, right? I don't really know. There's going to be a wall put in here. Winter has begun. That's not good. So we need more heaters, probably. It is 35 degrees out there, 64 in here. So we can put one of those. I guess we'll get a vent between these two rooms at some point as well. I want a heater in there. And we'd like heaters in the bedrooms with vents between them. There's just barf everywhere. So then this is going to be a butcher room. This is going to be a cooking room with a table, which is not a great play, but what are you going to do? We can almost push this back another notch and mine this line out. It's not going to hurt. It's just dead space. And then... Then we can get a cook table here. Then we could put a wall across here and have a couple tables in here. Just chilling, eating space. Look, Brittany's back. <gasps> Call the cops. All right, Brian's getting all the shit hauled in that's everywhere. Frank's visiting a grave. That's just fine. There's plenty of crops that need bringing in in a minute, so Frank should get on that shortly. We killed enough people and took enough warm clothes. Brittany's bald head is going to be cold, that's for sure. Nothing we can really do about it until we get a tailor bench up. They're telling me I'm low on food, which is fair because we have one meal left. <laughs> no. Alright, so what we're not going to do anymore is we're not going to sew. It's winter. So how about you don't do that? It's 33 degrees. It's barely over freezing. Where are you going? Ah, Hilbert. Is there anything else down here while he's down here? Hopefully he'll do that one and then these. And then Brian will bring it all in. It's free food, right? I guess. Is that one ready? No. So we've gone up to eight medicine. That's decent. While I have them out here, I'm just going to put them to real work. There's more. Brian's got to come down here anyway. There's a medicine down there. The old Frank. All right, that's fine. Minor break risk on someone. All right, that should be good. So, yeah, then by the time he gets back up here, hopefully, I think I'm just going to set all these to harvest. Orders. Orders. <laughs> harvest everything we can. It's winter. The cold's going to kill it before too long. Brian Fallon is in love with Britney Spears, man. Oh, so is Frank Turner. We need some more women at this colony. Or maybe a gay dude would be fine too, but... Harvest botched. I might have to get all this crap out of here. So, I, like, some of the stuff that's just... We have poor knives laying around. We have a wooden club laying around. Okay... All right. Well, thanks for watching, guys. I have to put another break in here. We're going to focus on getting our cooking and butchering areas set up properly next time. See you later.